Hello and welcome to my channel, My DC Collection. Today we're going to be doing the unboxing and the review of the Superman Premium Format Edition by Sideshow Collectibles. Right, let's get this bad boy unboxed, shall we? Right, guys, it's out of the box, it's out of the shipper box. We have a little bit of damage on the box, but not to worry about that. We have a picture of on the front of what's inside. That's cool. And the side, another lock. And on the back, ah, Superman's logo. My box is a bit damaged again, but not to worry. Looks pretty cool. My box is a lot damaged. Right, anyway, let's get him out, shall we? That's the important thing. Okay, hey guys, I've got him out of the box. Let's have a look, see what we have inside. Right, straight at the top, we have his cape. Supposable cape on this one. Nice yellow symbol. Looks good. Let's fetch your mouse. Bit of card inside, keep it nice. Impression, I'm not sure if I like it. Huh. Hmm. Right, anyway. Okay, okay. Initial disappointment out of the way. This is the exclusive edition, so we have got the extra hand holding Brainiac's head. Nice green blood all over. Right. Okay, let's get in the But so the base is tricky to fetch out. Whoa. Well, this is them, I actually got two underneath. It feels weird. It feels good. The price is brilliant. Oh. Oh, that's never a good sign. It, it, it. There's something going ding, on the cross, and we've got a broken piece. Oh, wonder. Yeah, a little bit's broken. I'm not sure where it's broken off. Yeah, I've got this extra packing, you say, try and protect it, must be one of these, it's come off somewhere, but where, we will have a look in a bit, right. it's the bottom of the base, I've got 1,433, oh, alright, let's put the base down, oh, it does look quite cool, the base actually, okay, let's pop the one there, Move that bit. Right then. This is what we say after we've took the base out. Superman's head. The extra hand because it's exclusive. There's his body. Another hand there. Those fists, and then parts of the base, look. Okay, let's get this built then, shall we? See what we got. Right, guys, I've had a hunt around. I've tried to find where this piece come off. I can't find it anywhere on the base. Anyone's got any ideas, drop us a comment below. Obviously, I won't get in touch with your side show, but 
if I can't even see where it come from, it's not really worth going to the hassle of sending it back, I don't think. But that's it, just the one, if you doubt anyone knows where it comes from, give us a shout, because I can't find it. But anyway, moving on, broken piece of solid. We have the base, brand new school ship. Ha! Oh. Earlier impressions, I feel we're a little bit wrong. I'm loving this base, even though it's a little bit broken. We've got a big supermat. Get his body out. Body's quite got a bit of weight. The base is another heavy base. Like it, like it. Now, hopefully. It will go a little bit better than Batwoman's head did the other day. But, Australian. Australian, he said. Okay. Looking good. Looking good. Okay, let's get a hand out. So we'll do the collector's edition first. I'll pop his hands in. And, oh look at that, that's much better. See, Batwoman's hands the other day, they were really flimsy. But these, the pegs are a bit longer, they go in better, much better job. Ooh, I like the way that's painted, the symbol's painted. That looks cool, I hope you can pick that up in the video. Next hand, one close fist. We get the head next. Head feels really light though. He's looking up over there. Come back there. Alright. Next we have parts of the base. Hopefully we'll have no more broken bits. Hopefully. And there she comes. This looks really good, man. Detailing on, oh wow. Detailing on that is out of this world. Whoa, that's good, good job. Let's see if we can find a place to put it. There you go, like that. Is that where it goes? No. <coughs> Okay, move on to the next one. Having some technical issues? Don't know how it gets to go. So, this is why you need an instruction book. <laughs> Hopefully, if the guys at Dark Castle are watching, they'll know what I mean. 8 4. Yeah, Australian that time. Next one, where do you go? Have a space for you there. Oh yeah, in you go. Uh, we found where this one goes. That's the collector's edition, my Mrs. Cave, obviously. figured it out. Two little magnets inside there. Nice slide. Oh, he says. If he gets it right the way around. There we go. Okay, and this goes into there like that. I think. Yeah. Okay. And that one. 
push it down. And in we go. And we just got to sort the cape out, pose it. Seems quite easy enough to do. Quite movable. But let's say I'll sort that out in a second. Okay, guys. That is the collector's edition of the Superman Premium Former. And despite my earlier impressions, which I wasn't, mm, now he's out the box. Box even. Looking good. All right, let's swap him over. Let's see what he looks like with the exclusive hand. And Brainiac Scott. Again, that's quite nice. But all good. Look at that. We'll have a closer look in a minute once it's all built. And in he goes. Looking good. Okay, guys. Okay then, I had a quick go then in that time lapse video trying to have a quick look at the cave, but it needs a little bit more time I think. Right, I've just sat and I've stared at this, this for the last 20 minutes, half an hour, and I've got to say guys, my first impressions were so wrong. It's so cool this statue is. The paint, the detailing on it, just everything about it is just so awesome. I love it. Proper, proper. If you're thinking about getting him, get him. Get him, get him, get him. The way he's been painted, you can feel the texture on his suit. And this emblem, the way they've done that. Oh, so impressed, so impressed. I've got Brainiac's head in, all his green blood. It just looks awesome, absolutely awesome. All right, I'll take you in for a close up, see what you guys think. his head. Very snazzy curl on the go. There's the emblem. Look at his neck, all the veins. As I say, the detailing on this, these new statue, statues, <laughs> statues, sideshow I've got that coming out, and just oh, so much, so much, yeah, lots of words. As I say, the texture on his suit, look, I hope the camera's picking this up for you. Got a bulge in his trousers, too. <laughs> Can you see how they painted it? So good. The colours look so good. All his arms. Right. Brainiac's head. You see the punch? Look. Superman's arm and fist even. Let's take that out. You see how his fingers pushing into his skull look. So good. Put that back in there. It's in the right way. Washer. Right. Let's move a bit further down. So further down his legs. <coughs> huh. Kind of see two eyes there and a little face. <laughs> right, 
Let's get on this bass. There's the extra, there's a collector's fist. Base. This is Brainiac's school ship. Look at the detailing on this, guys. You don't really see the base too much on the photo. Well, you see it obviously, but you don't see how impressive it actually is. Move it around, all the damage from the battle. The tentacles coming out. So impressive. But like I say, I still can't find where the broken piece came out. Can you see all that detail in on this? Look at that, guys. Honestly, I'm really, really impressed with this. Can't wait to see it on the shelf. Like I say, this, it just, it just looks so impressive. He's 26 inches tall. Right then, I kind of cleared a space. I was going to put him next to Batman Supergirl, but the way his head's facing, I'm not sure. Right. Okay. And there he is, in his new home next to Supergirl and Batman. Honestly guys, he's a must. Absolute must. They've raised their game so much shocking. I thought Batman was an awesome. And this one, my days. Roll on when Harley Quinn and Joker come out. Okay guys, please do, if you've enjoyed this video, please do like it, comment, and if you're not a subscriber, please do subscribe. And thank you very much for joining me. Have a happy new year.